Hello again. I'm going to continue with the responding to JQ memes thing. It's just like really easy and doesn't take that much work to be honest, so I'm going to keep doing it. Today I'm going to be going over the all 10 of Biden's high profile pointees or Jews meme. And just like the other one, this is like pretty arbitrary who they choose. Like there are definitely Jews in certain like high level appointments in the administration. Yellen, Garland, Blinken, like are definitely top in the top five positions. It is telling that they don't include Kamala or uh, the Secretary of Defense in there who are like, I mean, you would definitely include that in like a top, you know, position in a presidential cabinet. I mean, Secretary of Defense is pretty important. Vice President is pretty important. Uh, especially if they were Jews, then of course they'd be included, but they're not, so they're not included in this meme. So that's just like a pretty obvious thing there. Also, when it also when it points to the Deputy Secretary of State and then the Secretary of State for Political Affairs, that's like obviously like kind of weird because those are just like, you know, subordinates to Blinken. But not only that, if you actually look, Victoria Newland is like fourth in line. She's not directly under Wendy Sherman. She's under Brian P. McKeon, I think that's how you pronounce it, who's the Deputy Secretary of State for Management and Resources. And technically Newland is under him in terms of like the hierarchy of the uh, Department of State. So it's just kind of telling that they have to like skip someone and go to like someone fourth in line uh, in one department. It's just kind of like grasping at straws. Um, Eric Lander, he was like the director of the Office of Science and Technology Policy, which again is like a totally like non-important department. I mean, it's just, again, it's totally arbitrary picking that one over others. I'll show like a list of all the people in the his cabinet and like certainly not the majority are Jews. But Lander isn't even the head anymore. He was there for like maybe about a year. And now it's some like Indian woman who leads that uh, department. A uh, similar thing with David Cohen. He was only the director of the CIA for like a couple months. And I'm pretty sure he was just like a stand-in, honestly, um, until they could appoint William Burns. I'm pretty sure that was, was what was happening because he was nominated in January and then sworn in in March. And that's like the brief period that Cohen was technically the head. So it was more just like a default thing because he was the previous deputy uh, CIA director. Ron Klain is Jewish. But again, and, you know, chief of staff, that's like an important role. But like, why not look at all the other departments? Uh, Avril Haines, I looked up, and she seems to be like half Jewish, but whatever. The Secretary of Homeland Security, yeah, he's a Jew. And then like, of course, Garland, Yellen, Blinken. Um, and those are like definitely important roles. I mean, I would say the top five roles are like the Treasury, Attorney General, Secretary of State, Secretary of Defense, and like VP. So they should have just stuck with that. I don't know why they're bringing up all these other people, because they're either just like deputies, or they're like leading departments that, I mean, it's totally arbitrary to list them as like, these are the top 10 departments or like positions. Like they're clearly not, it's totally arbitrary to pick these. And you can just look at the White House Gov website, the Biden cabinet, and it shows like in order of secession to the presidency. And so Kamala Harris is obviously number one and it goes down and it lists Blinken, Yellen, and then Lloyd Austin, who they leave out, then Garland, and then all these people who the meme doesn't mention until it gets to like, uh, Mayorkas, like, almost last, and then Avril Haines, and then Ron Klain is, like, the last of the list. Like, if everyone dies, Ron Klain would be president. So, just, yeah, totally arbitrary, dumb, low-tier meme. It was an easy one to pick apart, so, and it took all but less than five minutes, so, anyway, thanks.